Well, I have always loved that uh, great rap sound um, since a long time back. Many of my drum heroes had this sound. Before I knew they played Gretsch, I heard this sound and it was like, that's a typical sound. And later on I found out that, okay, they, it is actually that Gretsch sound. I think that for me, there is certain drums that's more typical Gretsch. Like for instance, my 22 inch kick that has, has a pillow, it's, it doesn't sound uh, typically Gretsch. But the 18 uh, bass drum and the 14 floor tom is Typically, I mean, so much all the jazz type. I, I totally love it, you know. And uh, but of course, the main kick and the 26, I can get great sound with as well. And I, I just love it. I, I love the sound. I love the logo. I love the history about it. And um, I'm happy that I finally um, were able to to change, you know, because it took me forever until. It was um, possible for me to do it. At home I have uh, more or less exactly what you see here, but old vintage drums. And uh, usually the, there is difference comparing old drums to new drums. There is a tone difference, like you play a Stratocaster from '71 and a brand new. It's it's a difference. You can't, it's more the new one is more plastic maybe. Usually the same would be with drums, but today was super fast. It sounds it sounds totally great, and it was super fast. I love the old stuff, uh, old design, and um, this in November and December I'm doing a long tour with Devin Townsend, and uh, I play on the, his new album called Empath, and if you open the album up you see all this design, it's like water and waterfalls, dolphins, and um, you know, blue colors, so I, I wanted to, I thought about that when I ordered this kit, that it should be something that will fit together with the, the album because we also will get the design like yeah, the art for the artwork from the booklets will be on the front on the kick drums so but I would have choose this color anyway I think because it's cool